um, on what we were talking about um, is as far as, uh, you know, the, the, the friend I, I was telling you about that, um, you know, he, he, um, I had tried to help him, you know, become successful through a program of, of being a life insurance agent and all that. And I didn't stop to think I wasn't empathetic. I wasn't empathetic enough to be like, you know, that's not what he really loves. What this guy loves is fitness above all else and fashion, you know, and, um, and, um, like I was saying as well, it ties into the fact that we live in a day and age where these big time entrepreneurs, you know, are coming out and saying, Hey, this shit didn't take me one, two, three years. It took me 10, 15, 20 years to get to where I am right now. Right. Um, but at the same time, so one of, one of my, my biggest inspirations, his name is Gary V and, um, I remember, I think, I think he was getting some scrutiny over hustling, right? You hustle, you hustle, you do whatever it is that you have to do to get that money. And that's not what he meant. And he actually corrected this. And one of the major reasons why he is my inspiration is because when he says hustle, he says, hustle on what you're passionate about. Hustle on what you're passionate about. People's passions, they vary. And that's where I messed up with that particular individual was thinking, Hey, I'm going to give you this great opportunity. And you're always going to hear that term, right? I have an opportunity for you. I have an opportunity for you. Um, and, and the problem with an opportunity being presented to you is that it may be an opportunity that you're just not fucking passionate about at all. You're right. Right. 